Authorities are now turning their attention to yet another emergency situation in Orlando. Yeah, rescue crews are desperately searching for a little boy who was snatched by an alligator at a Walt Disney World Resort. CBS North Carolina's Bershel Edme joins us li now live from the newsroom with more from what she's learned overnight. Bershel. Good morning, Stefan. What we do know is in the next half hour, Orlando authorities are expected to hold a press conference to update us on what exactly is going on with their rescue operation. We also know that at least 50 officers have been out throughout Disney World looking to find this child. Authorities say this happened sometime after 9 this evening, or yesterday evening, rather. The two-year-old boy was attacked by an alligator at the Seven Seas Lagoon. The boy's father tried to get the toddler out of the alligator's grip but was unsuccessful. The Nebraska the Nebraska family of five was in Orlando on vacation and enjoying some time on the beach when the alligator gripped the boy out of a foot or so of water. As a father, as a grandfather, uh, we're going to hope for the best uh, in these circumstances, but uh, based upon my 35 years of law enforcement experience, we know that we have some challenges ahead of us at this time. And the sheriff's office has tapped into several resources. That includes helicopters as well as dive teams and as well as uh, sonar equipment. Again, at 630, we are expecting to get an update from authorities, and we are working to bring that to you as soon as we learn more information. Live in the newsroom, Beershall Edmay, CBS, North Carolina.